Hello, hello, hello. Are we live? Hello. Are we live? I believe we are. Hello, are we live? We've got ourselves, as you'll see here. A nice looking new little chat box. Well, hey. Okay. So we're continuing on today. With the Far Cry Plat, of course. We are about to head into region number two. Which I'm quite excited about. Um, because we spent a long time on region number one. We're going to try and blast through region number two. And I'm looking forward to it. We are recording, we are live, everything is good in life. I'm just going to have a quick look at the trophy list. I believe we are on the correct number of trophies. 25 trophies out of 51 done now. So... We're doing pretty good. Let me just have a look at where we want to go. So we've got a story mission we get a trophy for. Another story mission. There's another story mission. So we've got a bunch of story missions. Now, one of the first things I want to do is I want to be able to make... I want to be able to do the bull mission, actually. I might try and just get that done now as one of the first things. So what I need is... Inside of here, I need to make the furious. In which case, I need prairie fire. Now, where can I get prairie fire? Because prairie fire, I can then make... I can make the furious, and then I can... Beat the hell out of a bull with my bare fists. So it is. Where is it? So where's Hope County Jail? The Hope County Jail's there. Is it? It's here. Yeah, it's right there. Is where we need to try and get to. So where's that marked? Somewhere two thousand meters away. Okay. That's quite far, so we will need a plane. Let's go to Rye and Sons and get a plane and fly on over there. That's the, going to be the quickest way over. Get a plane, fly on over, and uh, sort this shit out. Also, I need my I need my good AR back actually. I should have grabbed that, because I've got this shit AR that no one wants. Okay, hopefully it shouldn't take long to get over there flying full pace. I hope. Hey, we're already 500 meters on the way there. Perfect. So what we'll do is we'll get the prairie fire. Then we'll go back to the bull farm in John's region. Kill a bull. Get the achievement. And then... Go to Hope County Jail, which is in Faith's region. It makes you really realize how big the map actually is in Far Cry 5. There's the massive tower up there with like the statue on it as well, which is pretty cool. Shouldn't take us too long. Need my drink over. <laughs> 
flying on over. Let me just check that we are online. Okay, we're getting out. Parachute out. Oh please, I don't want to. I don't want to fight people. Oh, we have been very seen. Parachuting is actually terrible in this game. Like, just factually bad. So I think around here somewhere we should be able to find prairie fire. Where actually is that? So it's like just up behind us, I think. Location discovered, prairie fire. There we go. So now... We've made one. Let's get enough to make another, or a couple at least. Oh, I just consumed it. You dumbo. Okay, let's, um, let's fast travel to the bulls. Where's the bull farm? Over here. Davenport Farm. So we go here, we can punch a bull and uh, get this trophy, hopefully. Quick way of doing it. Okay, fast traveling loot makes you lose the effects as well. Where are the bulls? These are all cows. There's a bull. Okay, the tractors are out in full. Apologies. Okay, we're going to go punch this bull to death. So let's get our fists out. And then we will consume this. Come here! <laughs> One shot. Where's the beef? Tenderize a bull with your bare hands to death. Makes it a little bit easier when we can beat up one, uh, just one punch and it kills them. Oh my lord. I'm going to get some of this when I'm fighting some of the bad guys. This is going to make things easy. Look at this. Kapow! Oh, kapow! Jeez. Okay, well that's that one done. Um, trophy number. Okay. 26 trophies. Done and dusted. Okay, now the problem is we flew all the way over there, and I'm assuming we didn't fly anywhere with an actual fast travel point, did we? So, um, I kind of just want to hit up Hope County Jail as soon as possible. So probably fly there again. Better to not waste any time. Get moving. Am I actually lying?
I'm actually confused. Am I live? Oh, wait. Am I streaming unlisted? I am. Dumbo. Holy shit, guys. We've been fucking streaming unlisted for the past 10 minutes. I was wondering why there was literally no one in here. Is that working now? Oh my god, now we're live. What a twat. <laughs> I would have streamed for ages and just not realised that. Oh, that was so dumb. Who's going to be the first person to come in and realise that I was doing this? Not getting big for my boots, but I was like, no people? Really? Let me get rid of that mark on the map. That's going to annoy me. Um, there we go. What an idiot. Hello, Micah. Welcome in. Um, I've actually been streaming for the past, like, 11 minutes, but I had the stream unlisted because I was doing some testing yesterday. Um, and... I turned the stream to unlisted uh, to do the testing, and I forgot to turn it back, so I've been streaming for 10 minutes. I wasn't expecting loads of people to join, but literally not a single person joined. How dumb is that? How dumb is that? How are you doing today anyway, buddy? Maybe now we'll actually get some people coming in. I was starting to be like, have I already fallen off? Already? I haven't even got started. You're good? Awesome. We are... I'm just about to start the second region. It's really annoying. I actually just got the achievement, the trophy for beating a bull to death with my hands. So annoying. Because no, one, no one's going to have seen it on the live stream. And now we are hitting up region number two, which will involve... Going towards Hope County Jail. Oh, I didn't get my gun, so I'm having to fly in with this crap gun. Okay, eliminate the enemies. Okay, we are in there like swimwear. Let's get an RPG. Oh god, there's some, there's some bad guys. Hey, we did it. I'm excited for season two of Fortnite. I haven't played Fortnite in quite a while. What is what is the next season of Fortnite? Didn't, didn't you? Was it you said it was like Greek or something? I literally haven't seen anything about what's happening in the next Fortnite season. But I'm always intrigued. Fortnite always brings me back. Base Strange, hello, hello, how are we doing? Um, I was just explaining that I've been live actually for the past like 15 minutes playing this and I was, uh, my, my stream was unlisted on YouTube because that's the thing you can do. It's actually very handy because it allows you to do tests and stuff uh, without uh, without uh, people who you don't want to be online being able to see it. So, um, yeah. Done by me, but we're here now. Oh my god, okay. Let's just not instantly die. That would be good. Uh, we're currently trying to take back Hope County Jail, which is the main area, or like the hub of uh, the area, region number two, uh, which is owned by Faith. How's the day been for you? Today's been pretty good. It's been a busy day, I will say. Busy, busy day. Okay, where where are you going? I love sniping in this game. I'm so glad I've got this sniper. Oh god, there's a guy trying to jump up. No, you don't. No, you don't. Oh my god, there's another one here. No, you don't. There's another one? You're gonna keep going. 
have your day how have, how has your day been base ranger ask mike how his day was um we don't see busy day or chilled out one how has your hump day been Yeah, don't forget to like the stream. Thank you very much, guys. Oh, God, the speaker trucks. Not the speaker trucks. That's one. That's two. We've got the third one drove straight in. Okay, eliminate all remaining enemies. How do we get back up? I jumped down here because I thought it'd be cool. Where did I put my AR? Wait, I thought I dropped the AR on the floor here. Oh my god. Crazy fanatics. Do I stream on Twitch? No, currently I only stream on YouTube. Potentially in the future, I might do like multi-streaming, but I actually don't like the idea of multi-streaming when you start streaming. I mean, what would I know? I'm not a streamer, really, but I just feel like focusing your time in a single place, especially, I mean, my whole content is YouTube-focused, and everything I've always done is YouTube, so I just feel comfortable streaming on YouTube. You know, I need to find my footing one place first. Oh, my God. Have you done it? We done it. Rogers, there's an Arkweller somewhere inside. Buddy was using it last. Get on it. Well, you're with me. Let's start collecting scrap. You have to pull the doors off some of the cells. Do it. Now hop to. We ain't got much time. Any problems? No. A couple of the Peggy scaled the wall, but we got them. Door. That doesn't look too bad. You'll be all right. Just keep pressure on it. You know, I was going to retire last year. I was worried I'd get bored. Are hey, you going to introduce us, or we're just going to stand around here all awkward and shit? Language! Oh, fuck off, Virgil. Not today. I have told you a vulgar mind is a... My day's been a bit sad. School is frustrating and family issues. Oh, that sucks, dude. I'll need a casualty report. We're, we're cougars! Well, we're really not. I would say things can well, only get better. So... Hold that hope, buddy. Person I'm sorry, who is this? This is one of my deputies. I have a break now, a skiing break? I thought you said your deputies were taken. No, this one wasn't. Been giving Eden's Gate a hell of a time from what I hear. That's so. Well, I hope you plan on pitching in. No room for freeloaders. <laughs> oh, Tracy's all right when she gets to know you. She's right about the work, though. Plenty to be done around here. Just ask around. Good to have you back, Rook. Okay, then. Mama always said nice I'd come here, but I bet she never saw this coming. First time I ever hunted. University types. I think they have the monopoly on the deputy. None of my business, but you might want to ask Virgil. Absolutely, no problems, dude. Sorry if I sorry if I keep answering my phone. Um, I've got some other stuff going on as well. Um, with friends and stuff, but it's fine. Um, I am locked in now. We've got the Hope County Jail unlocked. Oh, can I get out? Gonna be honest. Never thought I'd see you again. What do you want me to do? Okay. Last two days, we've had a few people go missing. Only from what we can tell. They weren't lost in the bliss. There's been rumors of some place run by Faith's favorites. They took over the, the kind of place nobody. Oh, so how do you guys like the uh, the chat? How it looks below. It looks a lot better than um, the last time. Do I have a Discord? No, I used to have one for my old channel, but at the moment, no. And I'm I'm not going to set up anything at the moment um, because when I set one up previously, it was just it just became this place that I just sort of didn't moderate, and it just I, I wasn't a fan of it. Maybe if we if we build the I want to build the community here in these streams at the moment. 
Um, and then we'll see in the future where that takes us, you know, step by step. I don't want to jump straight into... I, I, I've made that mistake before. And that's no offense to any of you kind of guys, but I've just... Uh, the internet is an interesting place, let's just say. Your sheriff seems to know what he's doing, though. Tracy, I've seen around. Okay. Mostly keeps to herself. And Virgil, well, he's Virgil. Can I... I I want to accept a few different we got one missions. Job around here, and that's to stop Faith. She took everything from me. My job, my marriage, even my son. All because of that bliss. So from what I remember, the bliss us. is basically this like drug that everyone gets. That like it, it makes people go really crazy. Right now, deputy. You know about our water treatment plant? The cult took it and started pumping it full of bliss. You believe that? Right into the drinking water. What kind of monster does that? Well, she's not getting away with it any longer. I tell you straight, we're gonna shut it down fast. What do you say? I'm ready. I've got this. Hell yeah. Do I have an Instagram account? I want to. I want to follow you on it. Um, I. I. Don't even know if I do. I used to have an Instagram account, but also, unfortunately, like my personal stuff, like I, I only have like a personal account stuff. I don't have a, you know, Dave Beats Games account or anything like that. I've got a Dave Beats Games Twitter account, so you can follow me. Um, it's actually Four Eyes YT because that's my. But I might change it in the future. Um, I'll just put it in here if you want to follow me over there. Four Eyes YT. Um, you can follow that over there if you want to. Um, I might change it. To be honest, I'm, I'm in a bit of a weird transition period at the moment between potentially two sort of like, um, two different channels with very different names. It's a bit of a weird situation. Where is the gun? Is there a gun shop here? I thought there would be, but maybe there just isn't. Yeah, there is. Where the fuck is it? General shop. Have I, did I just literally, oh, it's literally here. How dumb am I? Okay, let's get myself my weapon. Um, da, da, da. So, where's my AR? Oh, yeah, it was this. So, it's the AR. Yes. Swap that with the RPG. The other thing I want to do, I've just realized that something I can do now, is my perks. I've got 21 perk points, and I can get weapons collector, which allows me to carry four weapons now. So I've knocked off a bunch of the ones I wanted to knock off. I think there is a trophy we can actually get for um, for perks. Let me just see. Can I get a trophy for perks? Um, let's purchase half the perks. Yes, yeah, so I've got a... I've got to purchase 25 perks. Okay, and I've got how many? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, well, they're not going to be useful. Luckily, I mean, these are pretty cheap. But do I want them? Are there any other, like... I mean, I could just get, like, close combat. Let's just get a load of cheap ones. I don't think there's many up here that I'm, I care that much about. Fisher King we definitely want because there's a trophy later on where we do fishing and that's going to be important. And Repair Torch is pretty handy. You can use it to open safes. King of the Jungle, reduced animal attack damage. Black Market, craftable stuff. Health Boost 1, that's pretty handy. Let's just do that, because that's probably going to be more useful than a lot of other stuff, which I could end up picking. Cool. So now we've got a load more perks, including we can get we can get another gun, can't we? So let's get another gun. What should I buy? Um, Apparently the AK is good. 
Gain five five levels of resistance in total. Ooh, apparently, yeah, apparently the AK is really good. I could actually get. Mm, no. Is there a semi auto fifty cal? Is that the SA fifty? Yeah, that looks insane. I think maybe a shotgun. We actually just don't have a lot of stuff. We can get this. But that's like a lot of money. Is that worth it? What's my favorite GTA game? Um, ooh, good question. Probably just GTA 5, if I'm going to be honest. I just wish you good luck on the most hardest difficulty. Um, they, I'm not playing on the hardest difficulty for this game because the hardest difficulty on this game is just like, it's not even like like hard fun. It's just hard boring. So I, I have not. I'm, I will not be playing that. GT5, good choice. Yeah, it's awesome. Um, I might just go for one of these. Well, I've already got this, but... I don't want to spend too much money, so let's just get a shotgun. Let's get the M30, M133. Um, and then I want to customize it. Do a little bit of customization. So probably put, put a little scope on it. Uh, put a little suppression on it and put an extended mag on it amazing and then our ar is honestly probably fine our sniper that we happened to have is also fine we've also got different fishing rods we actually need to get all the fishing rods that's another achievement but we won't be doing that until later um so i think we're pretty kitted now so now we've got Shotgun, sniper, assault rifle. That's awesome. Oh my god, it's bright out here. Okay, where do we have to go? Oh, there's another person to talk to, Tracy. She's up there. I want to get all of the... I want to get the, the, the main quest missions done. Because when I was doing the first region, I actually didn't realize how many points that, that those, those main missions give you. It is actually kind of Rookie, nuts. I got a job you're gonna like. Hey. We need to get all these before. done because you get achievements for doing cool. so. You get tro I keep saying achievements. After you get you get trophies for completing all these as well. Really good, but the rest, well, I'm working on it. So, restart. Welcome. You'll like the team we got. Everyone's strong, and we need to be with what's beyond those walls. I hope Earl's right about you. We've all been trying to figure out how to crush Eden's gate. You ask me, it starts with faith. At least that's what she's calling herself these days. You seen that giant statue on the hill? Of course you have. You can't miss it. Good old Joseph Seed, the father. Faith had her groupies build that concrete eyesore for her sick pilgrimage. You seen them? Those sad fuckers marching their way to that statue? It's horrible. We gotta tear down that statue. Let all those Peggies know their father ain't no fucking god. He's just a man. What do you say, Rook? Go drive a big fuck you size hole into that thing. Being in here, hey, it's the first time I felt safe in a while. Thing to a whole new level. They're totally obsessed. Okay, three missions up and running. We've also got some interesting um people we can recruit. Hello, this is Ms. Mabel. <laughs> we can we can actually we can literally get a tiger on our team. How insane is that? Okay. So where are the quests? False prophet. Clean Water Act and Salvation. Let's do let's do False Prophet because that's up a big mountain. That looks pretty cool. Ow! Grab ourselves a nice car. 
and get on the road. Oh god. Do you actually need to spend more money on vehicles? I'm just going to drop five grand on something cool. What vehicles actually handle well? Because I've driven so many cars in this game that handle, like, actual trash. I don't want to buy any of these cars or any of these. Yuck. Normal cars. Three thousand five hundred. Let's do that. And I'm gonna I'm gonna blow the rest of my money because I need to spend fifty grand overall in the game on cars. So let's just spend let's just buy this as well. Um and then we can spawn in this. I'm probably not gonna try and keep track of the amount of money I've spent on cars. I just merely need to buy enough. I mean this car looks pretty good, let's be honest. Why did it spawn my car somewhere where it was going? Oh my god. Okay, I'll put auto drive on. You can just get me there nice and quick. You just remember to turn off the radio. The, the fact the radio plays music and it's a lot of it's copyright is really annoying. Oh my god, a bear. Sorry. That was not intentional. If that was not <laughs> obvious already. God damn it, dude, drive. Is this the right way? I don't know where I'm being led. I'm going to turn off auto drive. I thought auto drive was going to help me, and it's just completely <laughs> leading me the wrong way. RIP Freddy, ba Freddy Fazbear. <laughs> Pretty much. God, I need to keep. Jesus. Oh, there we go. It's marked now. So, where the hell was it sending me before? How weird is that? This game is high on bliss. Seriously. Where the hell are we going? Oh my god. Stop. Stop. Stop it. Oh my god, where are we? It is really leading us like this really long way. Am I, I'm still being chased. Do you, like, mind? Chuck dynamite on the floor. <laughs> Get lost. Drive. Drive, goddammit. Drive. Arthur, drive. Drive, goddammit. God, this is the longest journey ever. We're gonna make it to the top of this mountain. We're still a thousand meters away. We've gone for the most roundabout way of doing it. I swear. I'm actually gonna let these guys out because we're gonna get points for it.
I don't understand how... They're really annoying. They just drive off every time I'm just about to get them. Okay, now it's time for the, the ascent, I assume. Police, but illegal. Yeah, basically. I do what I want in this game. Completely. No one can stop me. I'm unleashed, you see. Oh my god, I didn't realize I didn't realize I could shoot the I can shoot the guns out of this thing. Wow. That would have been handy. Well, we know now. Now we know. Yeah, bro. Did not know that. Actually badass. Look at this thing. Like, hell yeah. If you find yourself running low on funds, the best way to make a quick buck is to go hunting. There's a lot of folks out there who'll pay good money for meat and skins. Yeah, that's actually a good point. So when I need to buy loads of uh, vehicles, one of the best ways to do it is to go hunting. Um, get a load of money from hunting and then use that. Um, which I never really realized. Okay, here we go. We're at Joseph's word. Something with a mounted gun that flies. Hmm. So, like, a helicopter? Or a plane? Maybe? Okay. Are there lots of bad guys here? I would assume there must be. This looks like a breeding ground for bad dudes. Rocket launcher. Okay. Oh my lord. Okay, the, the, the people here are not going to be happy at me doing this. Oh, they are really not happy. They got a lot of snipers. I got a sniper. Oh my god. How did I fall off there? Fuck's sake. Hello, William. Welcome, welcome. Mike, you're doing God's work, asking everyone to like the stream. Because I never do it. I never ask anyone to like or subscribe. I should, probably should ask, ask people to do both those things. Oh my god, we're back down here. How annoying was that? But hello, William. Welcome in, welcome in. How you doing, buddy? I'm in region number two in Far Cry 5 and um, starting off the main the main quests because uh, there's, there's a bunch of trophies for completing main quests. In this one, we are taking out Joseph's Word, which is this massive statue. Now, I might try and actually... Where? Ah, oh, hello. I might try and take out snipers first. That's not a bad guy. Is that someone we can liberate? Not yet. In the future, likely, we can. But for the moment, nope. Once again, they ain't going to be happy. Let's try and get a load of these out. You're great. Good to hear, buddy. Okay. Oh my lord. Let's take this. Let's do this smart this time. Oh my god, there's a sniper. Let's take out the sniper on the statue.
shit, missed him. There we go. Was there another one? Oh my god, there was a guy further up. How crazy is that? Look at these angles they're hitting me from. Make it, make it, make it, make it, make it! No, what am I doing? Maybe I just need to... Okay, I'm just going to focus on shooting the thing. I'm just going to focus on shooting the big uh, the statue. I'm not going to do anything else. Because taking the tactical approach is not working. That statue is one fat hunk of cement. You're going to need heavy ammo to take it out. Let's just go straight in. We're going in dry. You're smart. You'll figure it out. I'm, I'm just gonna. I'm gonna lose the tactics. Tactics will only get you so far. Sometimes you just gotta go for it. I'm actually gonna ditch the shotgun for now. Also, I think if we take out the top bits first, that's better, because then we don't reveal the areas where people can pop their heads out and shoot us. See, like, we've almost done it already. Stay behind cover. They got a lot of I think it's just this left one. There. There we go. Statue destroyed. We can see your work all the way at the prison. Goodbye to that waste of concrete. Hey, if you're looking to cause more trouble. Okay, let's get idea. ourselves in there. Her personal copy of Joseph's ramblings inside that thing. Oh my god, can I not get this out? I'm actually just dying because of fucking if I die here I'm gonna be so annoyed. I couldn't get I couldn't change weapons properly. What happens when you drive off the mountain? Um, your car probably blows up. <laughs> would be, would be a good assumption. Okay, we've got everything we need now. Oh my god, hello. I'm really glad I've grabbed a shotgun. Oh my god, there's actually a lot of dudes in here. Yeah, shotgun was such a good idea. We've now got access to three main weapons. Okay, let's climb on up. Do it for the father! You ain't gonna do nothing, bitch. What am I doing? Pulling this? Okay, that brings the ladder down. Choppers? Oh no. I don't have my... I don't have the, the rocket launcher anymore. I might need a rocket launcher. Very likely. Climb, 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 climb. I hear choppers, but I don't see them. Where are y'all? God. Joseph Seed ain't happy. Aha, there we go. I'm absolutely happy for you to come down to me. Oh, there we go. Oh, just, just, just get lost. Just get out of my game. I'm an animal with the sniper now. 
Now that I'm like locked in properly, I just actually, it's 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 easy. It's ju it's just too easy. Where am I meant to go now? Plow here? No. Aha, do some climbing. There we go. I've got to be very careful. I am very high up. Luckily, I can wingsuit off of here at the end of this mission, so I'm actually very glad I came here first. It'll be a smart way. RPG the heli? I didn't ha I, I dropped my RPG at the bottom, unfortunately. I definitely should have brought it with me. Although, to be fair, I didn't really need it in the end, did I? I'm too good. Oh, God. Where now? Oh, uh, over there. God, the, the, uh, the FOV on this game is so zoomed. I'm not used to whatsoever. This is giving me uh, flashbacks of like the old Far Cry games where you had to do a lot of the climbing. There you go. Here's the the Bible of Joseph. I'm gonna burn it to the ground. That's what I think of your Bible, Joseph. Unlock a wingsuit or parachute? Yeah, I've got, I've got a wingsuit. Oh my god, look at the, the, the sight from up here. Holy crap. I don't think books take fall damage. Yeah, they, they take fire damage though, for sure. Okay, so now we can go do the next one. So I guess we can go down and do clean water act. That will probably be a good one to do. Let's go. Oh no, I didn't want to parachute. There we go, wingsuit. Wingsuit on down. Let's fit on through. Oh god. We have hit the ground earlier than I would have liked to. Oh, God. Hello, Faith. You are right? Oh, no. What the hell? Whoa. <laughs> I don't last... I last a bit longer than that. Come on, give me some credit. <laughs> God's sake. I'm such a child. <laughs> I know you've heard stories about me. That I'm a liar. I am high as fuck. That I poison people's minds. Is that the crazy woman? Yeah, this is Faith. Well, let me tell you a different story. I'm not gonna lie, she's kind of bad. A true. Like, come on, she is. Everyone's thinking it. The crazy ones are always the best ones, guys. Remember that. There once was a young woman who had been ostracized by her community, bullied by friends, abused by her family. Rose Cappen? No, I'm not. It's true. To a needle. It's true. <laughs> cap, cap, cap. <laughs> she would no, I'm. I only she tell truth. Not you, her? Oh. Yeah, she is Captain. Absolutely. 
He gave her hope and confidence. The father showed her how special she was, that she was full of love and life. He gave her a new family, one that accepted her just as she was. The young woman no longer wished to die. She had been given purpose. One day, the father brought her here. He asked if she had faith in him. Hey, you get it? She had faith in him? He asked if she would be willing to die. I don't trust her. She gives me spooky vibes. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie, dude. I don't trust her too. I don't know what it is about her. Maybe it has something to do with the fact that like, we've got wings and we're flying through the sky. And I've been snuffing some of that good stuff. This 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 is a this woman. I, I mean, it's a very different kind of vibe to John's region, isn't it? I don't want to go to Eden anymore. I'm I'm good I'm good with where I am, actually. I'm good with being on this real world. Whoa! You must have faith. Let Show go. your faith and jump. Um, can I? Can I not? Apparently, we have to. Let Geronimo. Whoa! I am dead. I am dead. Oh my god, there's actually loads of dead people here. Oh shit, so she actually makes people jump to her death. Jump to their death, sorry. She literally drugs them and then like makes them go nuts and then convinces them to jump off. Oh my god. How nuts is that? Jesus. Okay. Let's just wingsuit to our next place now. Why does she do that? Um, because she's crazy. She's one of the bad, bad guys. She just is... She comes at it from a very different angle from the other guys. So John was all about, like... Um, getting rid of your sin, admitting to your faults, and all this kind of crap. Um... Faith is a bit weirdish. I think she's just very, very screwed up. And I think Bliss, which is the uh, the stuff that when you huff it, you're like, you go a bit crazy. Um, all, all of the bad guys are sort of in charge of that. Oh my god. There's a, fuck, there's a fucking cheater. I don't even know if that was a cheater, but... Holy shit, let's loot it. Cougar skin. Cougar. There we go. But yeah, to answer your question, I don't really know why she does it. She just does, because she's crazy. That's all we need to know. Probably because she's also huffing that good shit. Okay, so the next thing we're doing is we are going to the water treatment plant. Find a way to get into the pump rooms. Okay, there's gonna be a lot of people to take out here, I can tell. What was the Spider-Man into the Spider-Verse reference? I completely missed that. God, there's like no one showing.
God bless the silent sniper, you know? Literally, like, it's a game changer. I don't know why, but this mission feels like Elden Ring. Why is that? Also, what is the... Your name, dude. Your name is something and something. I can't see what the something is, because it's like a little emoji or something. Am I right? Oh, shit. Oh, you've all popped out of your little hidey holes now. Leap of faith. Oh, yeah, of course. You are right. I missed that. All these dudes just were hiding away. Now they've all popped out to say hello. This is why we snipe. Okay, not like that. I think when I last played this game, I sniped the whole time. Just easier. I'm not capping like her. I believe you. Let's get down there. Oh my god. We've not medkitted. So I think to get to the pump rooms, we need to swim. I don't know where we need to swim. All I know is I can't stay in here because this, this stuff is full of bliss. Oh god, there's a cult VIP. That is not someone I want to... Well, no, it is someone I want to mess with, but I need to get out of here. Oh, climb. There we go. Cult VIP killed. I can't remember where it is I need to go to get in there. I do seem to remember you get in there by swimming in. But I'm looking in here. And it don't look like that's what we do. Do we not swim through one of these? Huh? Where do we go now? Yes, emergency exit only. Emergency exit only. What about through here? Does this look promising? Potentially. This looks like it's leading somewhere, so we'll go through here. Just keep swimming. Eventually we'll get there. I think okay, I think we're in one of them. You can stop the water, but you can't stop the bliss. Stop it. Get on our way. Destroy the pumps in each building. What are we actually destroying? Oh my god, okay, there we go. That's those destroyed. How do we get to these ones? Oh god. Some dudes are rocking up. Shotguns and snipers. Anything that can one shot is just the best in this game because all the guns seem to recoil kind of horribly. I really don't like it. Oh shit. Actually, it's pointing me towards where I need to go. Wait, it is in there? 
Where do I need to shoot it from? Oh my god, that was a big explosion. But now I can get through. I actually didn't think my bullet would go that far through water, so I just didn't bother. Swim, god damn it. I don't want to drown. Oh my god, I'm not my guy's not happy. Get up out of the water. There we go. Amazing. Ooh, there's a big barrel. This might hurt me. It didn't. There we go. Clean water act. Yeah, so where we're at. Destroy cult water treatment and make them thirst for revenge. Yes. Yes. You will thirst for revenge. Okay. I knew I'd get, um, I knew that some of these, uh, achieve, oh. Ah, uh, if I die here, I don't really care. Yeah, I died. Um, yeah, I knew that some of these trophies, you, you can get trophies from, um, from missions. I just need to keep going for it. But yeah, so basically what's happening is they're, they're put, they, they're feeding this bliss, which they make from these plants, and they're feeding it into the, um, the water system. Which is obviously not good. It's obviously not good at all. Okay, um, where do we need to go next? So we need we want to go over here for salvation. Um, let's... Where, can we get planes over here anywhere? We probably can, but I don't know where. Let's go and do fast travel from here, and then we'll, we'll drive over. Yeah, rip, rip me. No, I, 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 I was fine dying there. It's fine. Literally fine. Rook, you're doing a hell of a job. Let's get another car, garage. Let's just get our... Oh, I want to get the one... I definitely want the car which has the gun. Now that I realise you can shoot with it, I am very intrigued to keep driving this and actually try it out. Okay, so we need to get to here. Off we go. Be careful out there. The mist's rising. Gonna make you hallucinate, and if you breathe it for too long, well, you could wind up like the marshal. Wait, horse out. Oh, another, another side I'm mission. All over the comms. The are Faith's gunboats. I don't really want to do Faith's gunboats at the moment. I'm gonna do this. Reach the misery. Like you very much. Solid work, deputy. Let's get moving. If you've just joined the stream recently, guys, please do leave a like on the stream. Helps push it out to all the more people to come join and chat and get involved with us. So that would be much appreciated. Go away. I hate... I, I, people are so persistent in this game. It's actually insane. Oh my lord, move. I'm actually going, I'm actually going to die. Drive. It's, I literally find myself almost dying all the time in this game. I hate it. Um, wait, how did we not die when we jumped off the mountain? I actually don't know. Maybe I'll like, maybe because we have, I don't know. I'm not even going to try and answer it. Unless we didn't actually jump off the mountain, because we were already down the mountain, so I don't think we, we went up to the top again and then jumped off. I think we were just led to the bottom. Maybe she didn't want to kill us right there and then. Who knows? I won't try and I won't try and decipher it at the moment. We'll just say we're happy to be alive. And leave it at that. Okay. I think the problem is, is when you drive around this area now, because we've been huffing that bliss, we start seeing a lot of stuff that isn't actually there. Um, oh, we can get a boat. Let's get out and get grab a boat. It'll be quicker. Plot armor. Yeah, pretty much. 
the finest plot armor that the that money can buy. Oh, there's a clutch Nixon down there. Don't know why. Why did it show me that? Civilian rescued. Let's go get a boat. Is there no, do I not have any boats? I don't have a boat. I have a seaplane. <laughs> oh, let's just get the seaplane and fly on over then. I'm not, I'm not swimming. You can take that idea and shove it. To be honest. That's what I think of that. So this is the misery. Rooka, don't think those were rumors. The scout team just reported in a cult priestess is spotted heading your way. Can't be a coincidence. You only have a few minutes to secure that area. Move carefully in there. Okay. You probably have hostages. Probably have hostages. Okay, this means we've got to go silent. Gotta be very careful here. We're doing a really good job here, though. Where is the one that is apparently seeing me? Oh, he's there. Okay, there's one last dude left. I'm not gonna lie, we have cleared this effectively, haven't we? Also, I've done all the takedowns, so I don't need to waste my time doing takedowns anymore. Shit, 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 shit. He might call in more people if he sees people. What? Is that it? Air is secured? That was all the people, right? Have I not liberated this area? Huh? God, I love secure area. It's secured. Hey, I'm back. What happened? I am liberating this, um... This place. Except it's saying secure the area. I have well and truly secured this area. Like, what is the area? Like, have I been screwed? There can't be more guys hidden. They would have come out by now. We need fresh blood. Maybe these unbelievers will see the. Oh, hello. There was actually another guy in here. <laughs> these silencers must be pretty good on these guns. If the that that guy had no idea, I just killed everyone here. Ambush the priestess. I used to take my stuff to a repair Who is the priestess? <laughs> I hope you're ready, Rook. If our timing's right, that priestess is going to arrive any second. Kill the cult priestess. Oh shit, they're coming. Okay, here we go.
Oh! She got back in the car. Like, instantly. We almost lost that. Done. That's it, right? Save the remaining hostages. So are there more hostages? I don't remember seeing any more. Save the remaining hostages. Where are you, hostages? Oh, I'm going like... I'm getting pretty blissed up. Man, am I faded? I have no idea where... Save the remaining hostages. Oh. How do I get you down? We can save your marshal, Deputy. Don't worry. Um How do I get you out? Oh. There you go. There you go. That's all of them saved. And that should be that mission done. I think. I got the word you killed that priestess. Yeah, it did. She did. You got the cougars back here nice and fired up. Hell of a job, Rook. Hell of a job. Salvation completed. No trophy for that one. Okay, so now we can go get the mission from Dr. Charles Lindsay. Can I go get... I'm going to go get another boat plane. I forget that. I forget you can get seaplanes from the boat garages. That's actually really handy. They're not as fast as the proper planes, I don't think. But... They are available. Because you don't need a... Um, what you call it? You don't need a runway, so you can just get them all over the place. Sell that. We got lots more hostages out there. Face our people are torturing them or turning them into angels. Scrambled eggs, as Tracy says. You find them, Rook. They're down there. Set them free so they can come home. Okay, where is it we're going? Over here. We've got Serve and Protect, which just came up, so we'll do that one after. Serve and Protect, save hostages. Oh, you just got to save normal hostages? Not too hard? Jazzy, hello, hello. First time seeing you in the chat. I have watched a bunch of your videos, dude. How you doing? Nice to see a fellow... British achievement slash trophy hunter. Oh shit. Oh my god. Save myself. I hate these parachutes. They are actually horrendous. And also, I'm about to land in the middle of everyone. Which is certain death. Oh my god, no. Get out. Get up. Get up. Get up. Run, 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 run. No, I appreciate it, bud. Great, thanks. How are you? Yeah, very, very good, mate. Very good. Just, uh,. Finding my way through Far Cry 5, which I have played before, um, but I've never... That's the thing, there's so many games you'll play, and then when you actually go and you do trophy hunting or achievement hunting on them, it's it's, it's, it's a very different experience. Um, especially because I'm actually typically a mouse and keyboard PC player. Uh, so moving back onto one of these to play shooter games, of which... Three of the games I've played have been first-person games involving shooting already on this channel. Uh, it's it's not the easiest. It's not the easiest. But uh, luckily, I've got a trusty sniper, which makes some of this easier. Like, I should be able to take this guy out. I missed. There we go. You down. That was me with Mirror's Edge. Mirror's Edge, 
I would love to actually um, grab achievements for. I love Mirror's Edge. Never played Mirror's Edge 2. The grind is beyond insanity and it tainted my entire thought of the game. I, I'm actually a bit scared with some of like the pure grind ones. I don't think I will find myself doing any of the like pure grind um, trophies, at least for a while, unless like I can obviously see something being very popular. Because I just, I think by the end of it, I'm gonna be so mentally distraught. Like I'd rather put myself through Oh my god, I might die from that. I'd rather put myself through just really hard, um, like a really hard achievement, something like a Meinleben, um, or I guess like some of the some of the Call of Duty ones, which are just kind of nuts. I'd rather put myself through that because at least I know the outcome of the video will be, it will really show that difficulty. Whereas I think, like if I do like some of like the Lego trophy, trophies and achievements, I like think it's like Lego Star Wars where it's just, I don't even know how I could make that, like, entertaining, unfortunately. What grinds do you mean? Like, what games? Um, what will be good examples? What have, I, what have I seen recently? Hello. Um, oh, what games have I seen? I know, so, so the Lego games are, yeah, yeah, the Lego games are some of the biggest ones. It's where you have to collect, like, it's like, collect five million studs. And you're like... And basically, to do that, there'll be, like, an optimum way to do it from start to finish. But, like, I, I just... I don't see how to sort of turn that into a... into a video that I would I would really like. Um, whereas, like, when I did my COD 4 Platinum Trophy recently... Um, that was, like, what, I think recently. It was a few months back now. Doing Mile High Club on that. That's just, like... It's just, like, content gold. Because I was losing my mind doing it. Um, and it's fun going back and editing it afterwards. And then when you get to the end of it, it's like, it just feels great. It feels really good. Yeah, Mir Mirror's Edge is Mirror's Edge is awesome. If you haven't played it, Mike, um, Micah, it's uh, it's basically like a parkour first person shooter single player game. It's awesome. If it's, if it's not a game you've you've ever heard of, I hundred percent recommend that you go check it out. You probably must get it really cheap now. I've never played the second one, as I said. I've only played the first one. I'm not sure if the second one was deemed to be better or worse or, or what. Maybe I'll have to play it at some point. Would I platinum Minecraft? Um, so that's one, to be fair, that's one which I know that that's a bit, that's a gr that's just one of these grinding ones. But... Oh, Minecraft should just like bang views because it's Minecraft. I was thinking, if I, if I know that the game has, like, good viewership potential behind it, then maybe. But it wouldn't be at the top of my list, no. Hey, Hells. How you doing? Um, but yeah, Jazzy, what was your most recent achievements video you did? Because, I mean, you've been pumping them out. I've seen them. Because, I mean, to be fair, with the whole, like, achievement hunting and platinum trophy and everything like that, I've only really sort of got back into it. I sorry, I got into it at all. Um, in the sort of last half a year, I was pretty much down on the kind of content I was making. I had like a main channel, essentially. And um, I was looking I, I was looking for inspiration, if I'm honest. And I... Oh my god, I'm actually just taking so many shots. Oh my god, I need to hide. I might just die here. I need to heal. Please... Um, yeah, and I came across people like yourself, um, Rob, I am Rob, I, I mean, I know he picked up Platinum Trophy Hunting, and he's just fucking been absolutely slamming it, like, I'm a big fan of his content and his style, he's definitely an inspiration for the style of content I like to do, and, and, and yourself as well, the sort of, the mixing of, like, the good commentary, um, as well as sort of the live action moments, uh, I, I, so, who else have I been watching, obviously Nick, um, three point, bunch of stuff. Yeah, uh, yeah I, I, I have massive respect for Rob because, I mean, I, so I, I, I come originally from, like, the Call of Duty side of things. I made, like, Call of Duty, but more like guide content. I've always felt like I can articulate stuff well because I, because I did a lot of it, uh, educational guide content on that game, but I just found myself so uninspired by what I was doing. And, um... I saw that he was, I mean, he was doing stuff in sort of the COD scene for a little while, and a lot of his stuff was more like stuff to do with 
like entertainment stuff, and it wasn't really getting anywhere. Oh god, get absolutely shit on. Um, and then when he moved over and did the platinum stuff, I was in shock at how. Well, I wasn't in shock at how well it performed because, like, the f I think the first video he did was the Assassin's Creed video, and I was like, "Holy crap!" Like, this video is insanely good, and so I'm glad. And so I'm glad it performed as it as it did because, like, good videos perform well. Sorry, my name's Charles. I'm sure, back when I first started, the there weren't there wasn't many doing story breakdowns on the achievements as well. Yeah, because I mean, when I first sort of found myself jumping into this kind of content and exploring it, I would have I kind of initially thought, I mean, luckily I had the inspiration. I initially thought, oh, well, these kind of videos are just like, almost like the sort of the guide video style of style thing of like, here's how to get achievement. Here's how to get all the achievements or like, you know, just a list of the achievements or just a, just a playthrough. And I think that what this style of content really does well is it allows you to do that sort of let's play style that used to be really popular. It allows you to make it a bit faster paced, I guess, so it kind of sticks, it, it keeps up with the the sort of pace of what YouTube is now. And it also allows you to kind of flex on your editing and your commentary. And it also allows you to take people through a story. You know, you can break down a game that's 50 hours long in 50 minutes. And I think that's awesome because that's really good for both people who have played the game before or for people who have never played the game before but would happily watch an entire video of you going through it. Um, I did five years of DVD going nowhere. Really? I actually had no idea. Um, Hells, who was in the chat um, recently, who was in the chat recently, she's actually my partner, and she is a, she loves Dead by, she, she really likes Dead by Daylight. I don't think you've played it much recently, um, but we, we play, we play DVD, and we, um, we, we like it, but yeah, it really, like, with, with that kind of thing where you're, like, focused on one specific game and doing a mixture of, sort of, like, entertainment and educational or anything like that kind of content, you've either, you, you either, well, I suppose it's like any content, you, you either love it or you hate it, and I think that especially if, like, you stagnate in the content side of things, it can make you really resent a game. But, hey, you're smashing it now, dude, so, you know, good on you. And I'm hoping, I'm actually hoping I don't get killed, but killed by this bear first, because, holy shit. Sorry. Sorry, brother bear. <laughs> Hope to never play DVD again. It's fucking terrible. <laughs> oh... There's things about, I mean, to be fair, I only ever played it like surface level, but I saw loads of videos and sort of the complaints. I always, I like I'm, I'm almost like a min-maxer when it comes to those kind of games. I'll, I will look, I won't even just pick up a game and play it. I have this problem where I will research everything on Reddit about, about the game and people who play the game to really understand, is it worth me even installing it and playing it? And to be fair, after a, D, after a bit of time with a DVD and seeing that... You when you start getting properly into it, there could be problems. Yeah, I kind of stayed away from it, especially like the the meta of the game when you get to high levels and how like the balance and everything. It seems like a fun game which I could play with like a group of friends. I've had five people on. You could play like DVD games. We played um, Friday the Thirteenth recently. Um, that was on Game Pass, and we had a lot of fun with that. Um, but uh, yeah, I probably wouldn't go. I probably wouldn't. I I, I I couldn't see myself dedicating like that as my game. Uh, yeah, I'm like that. Um, and I'll tell you what. I'm dead. I'm dead tempted to get Helldivers two, dude. Helldivers two is is really good. Um, with 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 any of these games, you're like, ah, is it just like, is it just a flash in the pan? Is it not? I don't know whether I don't know what the longevity of the game is like overall, but it's a it's a fun game. It's so put off with the queue times. That, that, that's been sorted now. The queue times are really interesting because the queue, it, it literally had the MMO problem where, um, it, <laughs> where it had too many people for the servers. That's literally what happens with MMOs anytime they release. Like, I remember when games like Lost Ark, um, New World, and all those kind of games released, they, we, they had the exact same problems. But I've never seen a game like, like Held, like a game like Held Over, it's a co op game, just blow up like it did. It's a really fun game. Um, I've not spent much time playing it, like, solo or just queuing with randoms. I think it is really a game that is made for playing with at least, like, one friend, if if I'm honest. That's the only thing I would say. Um, I don't know what your situation in terms of in terms of going into playing it, but if you can get a little... If you can get a group together, it is one of the best co-op um, <laughs> organized madness experiences that I have played in in a while. 
they've they've nailed it. I think it deserves every bit of success it's got, and they have been working to obviously fix the problems with the servers. So they have, they have fixed that now. But um, that makes makes me want to go play it. Doesn't make me want to go platinum it. I've, I've, I, I, that that's one thing which I I used to have a problem with. I used to have a problem with every single game. That I would play. I used to be a let's player before I did COD. Just like play, did whole playthroughs of games. And um, I would just spend... Oh god. I would spend a lot of time debating over whether I'd play a game. Because I wasn't sure if I wanted to... Um, I wasn't sure if I wanted to uh, like... Oh my god, get off me! Ah, get off me! Dogs. Ah. Yeah, I, I would find myself being like... Oh, I want to... I want to like... I want to... Oh, maybe I should do like a let's play of this game. I mean, this was back when I was getting like 10 views a video. So I don't even know. <laughs> I guess I don't even know why I was debating over it. But I stopped myself playing a load of games because I was like, oh, if I play it, I'm going to let's play it. Or if I was playing games with friends, I'd want to record everything. I'm, I'm not like that now. I'm not going into every game being like, oh, I need to get all the trophies for it. No. Helldivers 2, I will just play it casually and have fun with it. Uh, hello, Callum Marshall. Welcome in. Love to Resident Evil 7 video. Are you going to do 8? Do you want to see something? Resident Evil Village. I actually picked this up when I picked up Far Cry. Um, because which is what I'm playing at the moment. It was it was in the shop second hand. And I will do this at some point. Whether I do it as my next game, I'm not sure. I'm, I'm thinking, oh my god! We're in this area where animals and bears and wolves spawn out of thin air. But yeah, so Resident Evil 8 is definitely on the list. Um, undamaged black like bear skin. Huh. Um, Hells, what was it you said about... What about Pal World? Um, sort of dropped off now? I mean, I, I don't actually know about Pal World, if I'm honest. Oh, pronghorn skins. Sorry, I need to go kill these pronghorns. I think this is a pronghorn. Um... Survival games will only ever have a certain amount of shelf life, I guess. But, but it will never just die because it, 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 there's not a reason to jump into it. Whereas a game like, a game like Helldivers definitely has like the FOMO going for it because it's this big co-op experience where everyone's sort of in it together and you, you you see the fun of it and you you feel like you're missing out. So I think a game like Helldivers definitely has the sticking power. Um, it's going to come... A lot, a lot of it's going to come from, like with any game these days does it get updates because people expect a certain level of like updates on certain things now where where are the things i'm looking for by the way two undamaged pronghorn skins i have no idea i keep seeing them walking around but i have like no ammo pronghorn skins probably have to probably snipe them Yeah, to be honest, for me, like, those kind of survival style games... Oh my god, there's a black bear. Please give me the undamaged black bear skin. Yes! Amazing! What is this helicopter doing over me? You can piss off. Micah coming in with another reminder. Thank you very much. Yes, guys, please do like the stream if you are sitting in chat right now and enjoying your time here. Um, be awesome to see and uh, helps push the stream out as much as possible. There's some more people in here. But yeah, so Callum, I will be doing Resident Evil 8, but maybe not as my next video. <gasps> Is that a... Oh, that's a... Um... I think we can blow up. I haven't actually seen many of these in a while. I don't know why. I just haven't seen them. A shrine. Ooh. Saved a hostage and killed a cult VIP. And subscribe if you haven't already. Yes! Subscribe. I will say, this, this niche of content is amazing for um, subscribers. Because a lot of people subscribe to this kind of content because they they like watching it. And, like, listen, I will never, like, toot my own horn too much. But, like, 
I feel like this niche fits how I like to do my content. You know, I've, I, I, I just, I just have, I just, I, I, it fits me really, really well. And I think I'm, I'm having a lot of fun just showing my personality in this, this kind of content streaming and creating the videos. So I do appreciate massively you guys who come and sit here and watch me play games. Like it's, it's, it's awesome. It is really, really awesome. Legend, thank you very much, dude. You're a legend too. Any, everyone, every single person who clicks on my content, watches it, for e for even, I mean, if you click it and just watch it and click off, then, uh, ooh, Sag. But, um, oh my god, there's a bear after me. I'm trying to have a heartfelt conversation. Please, do one. I feel like this bear is actually just going to chase me, isn't he? No! Maybe the bear will go after them. Hello, just watched your Resident Evil 7 Platinum Trophy gameplay and immediately subscribed. Thank you so much, Sergio. Welcome in, welcome in. Um, this is my first game that I'm doing like a proper like stream playthrough. I'm not streaming the entire game, but I have streamed a decent amount of it. Uh, so this is a bit of a new thing for me. So thank you very much for joining in, dude. Um, if you wouldn't mind leaving a like on the stream, then that is absolutely awesome as well. Um, how are you doing today, Sergio? How have you been? And... Um, what were your thoughts on the Resident Evil video? You enjoyed it? I had a lot of fun with it. I like Resident Evil 7 a lot. Resident Evil 7 video is amazing, bud. The thumbnail is also great. Dude, the, the, I, I love I love the thumbnail making for this as well. Because I, I, I've learned a lot of like thumbnail uh, making Photoshop related stuff. Um, just over, over time and... Yeah, that thumbnail really came out looking really good. It really popped. The the blue of the platinum trophy against like the 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 fire in the background, and then Jack Baker with the smile, which I used like a little bit of AI mod modification. It just came out really nicely. Um, and I'm sat there like I put it up there, and I'm like, oh my god, like I really hope. <laughs> yeah, I'm pulling my hair out over this thumbnail. What are your kind of thoughts on it? What's um the thumbnails can be. They can be the best thing ever, or they can just be the most like stressful thing ever. Because the last thing you want is for like a slightly, slightly worse than you want thumbnail being the reason where why like you know something just doesn't perform. It's such an annoying thing, you, especially with this kind of content, because you're, you're you're making like you know at least thirty minute videos, and then if the thumbnail's like eh, slightly not not good enough, then YouTube is just like nope, which is so annoying. Just can't find a photo of Jack that works for me. The angles just aren't right. That's the other thing, is trying to find, like, the right... The right bit. Yeah, I, I don't know where these deer are. Hmm. Hey, our little pictures are, are of him considering how big and great he is. You, you I, I, it's, ugh, it's the worst thing ever when you're just looking online for stuff, and all you find is like PNGs, which are like super low quality, or um, high quality stuff, but it's just like it's just not right. It's not the right angle. What did I just do? <laughs> I'm losing my mind. I hate hunting missions, by the way. Hate them. Where do I find these? This, these... Doctor's orders. Yeah, get, get two undamaged pronghorn skins. Apparently they're running around here. But Mans doesn't see them. I saw one earlier having a run around. And then since then, none. Okay, I'm going to lock in and try and complete this because this is probably the most boring stream anyone could be watching right now. <laughs> right, mate, my food's here. I'm going to go eat. Oh, what food do you got? That's the big question. What's the food of choice? I'm having a curry tonight. But not, a, not an interesting one. Just a, just a quick and easy. <gasps> Two pronghorns. Oh, no, there's no way I miss. I'm not letting you get out of my sight. No. Hmm. 
<laughs> no, please. Cheesy chips, pizza. Oh, cheesy chips, pizza, and jalapeno bites. Dude, I am like. That sounds like one of the most like yellow meals ever, and I'm I'm a massive fan of yellow food. I get my I get taken the piss out of all the time because like I love my yellow food. <laughs> it's such a it's such a British term, yellow food. Chips, pizza, chicken wings. Mm, I have soup. I love a yellow meal. <laughs> You gotta love a yellow meal. I'm actually just running past all these enemies to go after these stupid deer. Oh, now there's a cougar. Oh, I hate my life. Anyway, thank you very much, Jazzy, for joining in. Lovely to speak to you, buddy, and hope to see you over here again soon. I'll be keeping an eye out for your next video when it drops. Absolutely. Do you stream over on Twitch, by the way? Because to be honest, I only ever, I never go browsing on Twitch. I browse YouTube all the time. I never browse Twitch. Like, I will go to Twitch um, if, like, I have someone to watch kind of thing. I need to, I definitely need to use Twitch more. I've, I've just, I've lost these deer. There was three of them and I've lost them all. How sad is that? I do, yeah, I just can't stand YouTube's UI around streaming. I don't blame you. It is honestly it's not great. It it and it, and it hasn't it has never been. But um I've always dabbled in the YouTube side of things and I think with just bit building my stuff over here, I think I think I'm gonna stick with it at the moment. Maybe we'll do some multi streaming in the future, but hey. We've got we've got loads of choice now for streaming, so that's pretty good. Okay, I need to find these deer, because I am going to lose my mind. Literally, I am going to lose my fucking mind if I don't find these deer soon. Another cult VIP. I'll take it. Cougar, what is it? A cougar is, um... It's, it's like the tiger thing. No stripes or anything. You find them... They're, 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 this is like north... This is north... Northern um, USA. <gasps> Okay. How has it got away? There it is. Get back here. Like a puma. Yeah, like a puma. Like a puma. Just for the very first time. I am losing my mind. Oh! Oh my god, what a shot. Oh wait, it is a puma, it's another name for it. I never would have known that. That's actually quite interesting. I can't believe that shot. Now question is, do I get... Okay, yes, that's one pronghorn skin. We've spent about half an hour going after these pronghorns, by the way. I am, I really apologize. Also known as a mountain lion. Yes, you are right. You see, the problem with being from the UK is you have no knowledge of like wildlife because uk wildlife is basically pigeons and like house cats that's about that's about it I, I, why would it send me here if there's like two deer running around they have like three names here in the states whereabouts in the states are you from if you don't mind me asking sergio like you can handle a weapon. Obviously, you don't need to be too specific if you don't if you don't want to. I'm not like, what is your address? Like southern, northern, west, east, central. Once again, knowledge of the US also terrible. I did a name all the states quiz recently, and I was not good. It's, it's not even, it's not like it's not even trying to put the states in the right places. It's merely naming them all. Like abysmal. Do we don't learn it? Yeah, I mean, like, it's just not saying we're ever taught, because I guess why would we be? Around the Chicago area? Chicago's a place I would love to visit, actually. Like, 
I want to go to the USA. I've, I've actually, I've only been to the USA once, and it was when I was really young. Um, and there's a bunch of areas in the USA I would love to visit. Problem being from Romania is you don't know anything. You, do, you know nothing about the UK or America. Well, luckily, in terms of the UK, it's not a very big place. We're, we're, we're a little, we're a little, uh, we're a little nation. I don't know anything about Romania. Yeah, that's a good point. I don't know anything about, I don't know anything about a lot of European countries. I suppose it's just, it puts down to what you learn in, like, school and stuff. Oh my god. Uh, get off. That's a cougar. A mountain lion. A puma. <laughs> All of the above. Running away from that guy. Okay. 7.40 p.m. Dave is still looking for a puma. I'm not looking for a puma, I'm looking for a, a deer. Same old, same old. The fact I've had about four run away from me is quite, um, quite annoying. Oh my god. No, you don't. didn't want to kill you. I dropped sort of geography as soon as I could. Yeah, I'm not going to lie. Like, geography is one of these things where, like, day to day and in, like, conversation and stuff would actually be really nice to know more about. But it's probably just one of the most dull subjects in school. I'm just like, why would I bother? Why would I bother? When I what? No! No! tried to liberate her and it was fake to the oh we're back with this bitch again where are we going also hell i can hear myself actually from now i've just realized that you you're you've just got it you've got it blaring which is quite funny you've been invited i don't mind <laughs> I learned most of my world geography from football. I, football? You see, I'm not a, I'm not a massive football fan, which being from the UK probably sounds like blasphemy, because I feel like everyone, every guy in the UK likes football. But not, I'm just not really into it as a sport. Um, I definitely could get into it. Sorry, I'm in, the, I'm in the kitchen eating and watching. Well, hopefully you're enjoying it. Hopefully you've liked the stream. But yeah, like, honestly, football's a really good way to learn, because every... Because every... Every place in like every country has a football club it's it's worldwide so it's a really good way to learn places i guess okay let's let's focus on the story we all need guidance in times like these so we must be strong there's joseph must be vigilant now you'll see now you'll truly understand because those on the outside see what we have built here together in our new Eden. Love. And they will come. And they will try to take from us all that we have built. They judge me. They judge us. The things that we have done. People say that I'm crazy. This guy's capping. He has been the whole time. I did not ask for this. I was chosen. Can I get back to hunting my deer now? I didn't finish. Oh, no. 
can feel that. I know you can. I forgot about the random cutscenes. Yeah, this area has a lot of that happen. It's as as you fill up the liberation like meter, you have a lot of this kind of stuff happen. I can see that. You can see. But this one literally just pulls you out of what you're doing, which is kind of annoying. So what are we supposed to do? It's a bit of a weird way of doing the story because, like, you can literally. It's very non-linear. You can literally go through the game, literally, like, whatever way you want, and you'll just have these cutscenes drop in as you play. Like, it doesn't really have a, a succinct, like, start, middle, and end of a story. There's basically a start and an end, and the middle is all jumbled in whichever way you choose to do it. It, it works. It works. I'm regretting my soup. I feel like you regret half the food you buy. You literally buy stuff. You're like, that's a good idea. And then you eat it and you're like, mm, I don't, I didn't actually want that. Why are you regretting it? Oh, the bliss. The bliss. Oh, walk the path. Discover the bliss. Well, at least we've got a trophy for it. After sitting through that boring cutscene. <laughs> It's chowder, not soup, and I wanted soup. What even is chowder? Oh my god, what's happening? Oh, we we properly huffed huffed the good shit, didn't we? Got another trophy. Not forgetting to update the trophy counter this time. Jesus Christ, you scared the shit. We're on it. <laughs> hey, Sheriff. A couple didn't make it back. Boys anybody, said. Anybody grab Burke? Brady, supposedly, but. Well, where the hell's Grady? <sighs> okay, so shit, shit's got kind of real. Like, they are. They are deploying. Um, bliss everywhere. Easy trophy? Yeah, we, we love easy trophies. Oh my god, now I need to go and get. Okay. We complete the bliss? Is that what that means? Because I was in the middle of grabbing my pronghorn skins, and I'm kind of pissed that like you pulled me out of that. Oh, well, luckily we can we can go right here. That's actually so lucky. There's a fast travel point right next to it. Oh, you finished Hogwarts Legacy? When? When did you do that? Well, like today. Is that a solid work from home day? <laughs> I'm joking. Oh my god, bees. Swap bees. Why did I do that? Why did I think that was a good idea? Not the bees! Today, nice. Did you do you, did you play any Cal Kestis games? Oh, um What Jedi like was it Jedi Survivor and Jedi Fallen Order? I have not played those games yet. They're definitely games which I'm going to casually say they're on my list, which doesn't mean much because, like, I have, like, a million games which I would like to play. But I would like to play them, for sure. They look like great games. Just need to get all the collections and I'm sorted. That's awesome. That is a, that, that's a pretty grindy game. Like, if I wanted to platinum that, that would be pretty... Yeah, that'd be pretty, pretty grindy. I've literally been out here for an entire day trying to find these pronghorn skins. And I found one. There's one. Yes! That's it, I think. Oh, thank the Lord. Okay, let's go to Charles Lindsay. Is that down there? No. This is what I'm doing. This one. Okay. Reach his lab. Where's his lab? Oh, it's literally back at Cope County Jail. That's helpful. It's chill, so worth doing. Yeah, and I mean, and, and you're just playing through, you're just basically living out Harry Potter, aren't you? I remember ages ago, it's, it's actually kind of crazy when you look back and you think of like the hype behind games. And I remember ages ago when there was like rumors of a open world, like open world Harry Potter, like, uh, themed 
game where you become a student of Hogwarts and it's got like a story behind it, but you can sort of just go and explore all the grounds of Hogwarts. Uh, it, it almost sounded like undoable. Like, like how the hell are they going to pull that off? And I mean, and then it comes out and it's like, I'm not saying it's underwhelming because it's not, but it's just like, it just happened. And it was awesome. And then now it's like gone. And now it's, it's just come and gone. And that happens with all sorts of games. Did you hear they are remastering Star Wars Battlefront 1 and 2? Yes. Oh my god, hell, you, didn't, you never played Star Wars Battlefront, like the original ones, but they are. Once it's ready, you... Those games are childhood. Just incredible. I, I'm so excited for those. The, the amount of hype I've seen behind them is crazy. Okay, Doctor's Order's completed, finally. That was a ball ache, to say the least. Okay, I want to do one more quest today, um, and then we'll probably call it a day. Let's talk to this dude. I need to ask you something. You ever heard of a fellow by I feel a little underwhelmed with Hogwarts Legacy. Yeah, there's a pharmacist in town. I feel like I feel like it was always going to be somewhat underwhelming because it's such a it's such a gigantic world that it's stepping into. I played the new version. I played the new versions only one. Um I actually quite like the new versions, but they were like the new versions played more like battlefield games that were um yeah, played more like Battlefield games that are just with Star Wars skins on them, which is a bit... Whereas the original Battlefront games feel like Star Wars games. The lock picking is so easy, yeah. Yeah, like, would you say... Can you can you pick the difficulty on Hogwarts Legacy? So you'd say, like, certain certain bits are a bit uninspiring. It's just, like, it's a bit half-baked. Like, the, I think, like, the overall... The, they've, they've obviously done a lot of effort in, like, the actual overall world and stuff that you go through, because it looks... It's it's really cool that you get to go to all of those like places where you, where you saw in like like going into Diagon Alley and um, going to Hogsmeade and all that kind of stuff is really cool. But it then also just kind of falls a bit flat in certain areas, which I kind of saw from like I haven't played that much of it. I will go and play it at some point, but it just doesn't really. It's not that inspiring. I don't like that you have to get PS Plus just to play multiplayer. Well. I'm a, I used to be an Xbox kid, and Xbox Live always existed that you had to pay for, so I'm just used to that being something which you always have to do. Um, let me get this question from Charles Lindsay as well, because otherwise I'll have to come back here. Um, but yeah, because because I remember I remember when I was in school, like everyone who played PlayStation would always, like, their one thing, because I will stand by this to this day, Xbox 360 was way better than PlayStation 3. I will stick by that. Every other generation, PlayStation has won. Play PS2, way better than Xbox. Um, PS4, way better than Xbox um, One. And then now Xbox Series X is just nothing on PS5. I disagree. Uh, no one cares if you disagree, basically. Because Xbox 360, Halo 3, Gears of War, you, 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 don't, you don't have an argument. You, you just don't. That was like... That is... That is that is gaming. That's gaming peak right there. Unfortunately, <laughs> I hate to inform you, but I will. I will not. I will not be told otherwise. Um. Okay. Yeah, we're going here. Um. But yeah, and so and so everyone would. Everyone was like, oh, but but you have to pay for your online, and we get to play online. We get to play online together. Well, if you don't have money, um, it sucks. Um. We live in a world now where everything costs money and probably costs too much money, and it really does suck, unfortunately. If you don't have money, you can't play multiplayer. Yeah, it kind of sucks that you buy a console and then to even like, but it's it's a, basically that console on its own is a single player console until you pay money to to play online. Yeah, it's it's annoying. It's it's just it's probably a bit greedy, I would say. To just to just even like experience the multiplayer bit, you're not even like you're not really you don't even get anything else really for that for that base level. I think you get like a couple of free games a month, but like and you still have to pay for it. I, I think it's a bit lame because you can buy a PC and you can play online for free. Steam as an ecosystem, that's why Steam as an ecosystem is just so good because it's probably the fairest ecosystem of gaming that exists. It's tied to PC. It has every game under the sun. It's the, the games cost really good price 
and you don't pay extra for any of the services. It's just there. Um, but Sony and Microsoft can do what they want with their consoles, I guess, which is just... Uh, that's life, unfortunately. Okay, so we're going to the Jessup Conservatory. I'm surprised people are fine with me just flying about 500 planes over stuff and just crashing them. And they're like, yeah, that's fine to do. Oh, this is a um, it's an outpost. We actually haven't done an outpost in this region yet, which is kind of bad because outposts are good. I've just been focused on the quests and uh, talking with chat. I think the next the next period of this game I'll probably do off stream and I'm going to blast through it um, like an antisocial uh, gamer because I will be able to do it very quickly. Jesus Christ, this is a cool. Um, this is a really cool area. You clear the place. The key is burning all them bliss crops. That's gonna bring Feeny out of the woods. Good luck. Let's take out the guys in the peripherals first, because they're not gonna have anyone looking at them. We need to try and disable the alarms. We're screwed. Wait, are we screwed? Yeah, we're screwed. I thought we weren't for a second. The alarms are off now. They're NPCs, of course, they don't care. Oh my god, there's a, there's a turret. I'm so dead. Okay. Didn't play that well. I thought... I thought, foolishly, that the um, alarm was in that building, and it wasn't. It was out the back. I used to find the, the clearing of outposts in, in um, complete like silence really easy, although I'm wondering if that was Far Cry 3, because I think the Far Cry 3 outposts were way easier than these. Uh, these ones are actually pretty difficult. To be honest, we just need to sneak in and do all of the do all of the alarms first. That should be number one goal. Disable alarm. No. Let me, just, just let me die. Just let me die. Far Cry 3 used to just go around with my bow and do outposts completely unseen. Yeah. Like, that was how that game played. I, I felt like the outposts, the outposts were a bit more like... I, don't, I just don't feel like they had this many people. The outposts in this game have so many people. If you kill one of them, the rest of them are guaranteed to see you. Have I been spotted? I have. Okay, well, I'd rather be seen while I'm out here, because at least I can just... I'm going to climb up here and just snipe everyone. I just don't see any way that you can clear these outposts in any other ways from what I'm doing. Like just sniping people one by one. Surely it's impossible. Bro, I thought you were sneaky. I was sneaky. That's the funny thing. Oh, 
I was actually very sneaky. I'm not, I'm not really a massive fan of clearing out the outposts in this game. Which is weird, because it used to be... I mean, this is just a, this is a very different Far Cry game. And there's obviously been more effort put into other areas, I guess. But the outposts in this game, they look cool. But they're a pain to clear. And they're a pain for sort of weird reasons as well. More dudes have showed up. Oh my god, quite a lot more dudes. I appreciate this is thrilling. Oh god, to die. Almost done. Oh, there's one more dude coming. There we go. Like, I don't see any other way I could clear that other than how I just did it. I do like the little jingle when you complete it, though. That that makes it worth it, I guess. Oh, so this is a good outpost to have because it's very far on the side which of, of the map, which will probably be quite helpful. Okay, now we've got to burn the bliss fields. Oh, man. We need the Skrillex song playing while we do this. Do I have mollies? I do. Can I turn the water off? How do I turn off the... Oh, turn off the pumps like this. Here we go. Burn it all down. Yeah, I'm going to burn them. I'm going to burn them all. Go away. They're burning the crops. Stop them for the father. I don't know if a grenade's going to do it. Let me refill my ammo. Wait, that didn't burn them? What can I buy then? Can I, not, I can't buy... Molotovs? I need the black market perk. Okay, I'll, let me get the black market perk then, because I need them right now. I bet I don't have enough. I don't. No. I don't have. I don't have enough. How do I? How do I? Oh, I've got. A, I think I've got a flamethrower, don't I? I'll go over to here. I've got a flamethrower. Put that on temporarily. Here we go. Hey. Burn. Okay. Let's get our back our gun that we wanted, our shotgun. Oh 
Oh Gott. Feeny. Who's Feeny? Feeny. Oh shit. Once again, let's get the sniper out. Eliminate Feeny. Okay. Drive. This actually controls pretty well, this truck. RPG the heli. See, now RPGs aren't heat seeking though, and it's going to be a lot harder than me just chasing after them and sniping the guy. I believe, unless he just keeps flying, in which case this is going to be quite difficult. Get back here. Get your ass back here. Where is he going? He's actually like directly above me. Any chance I can get this guy out? Maybe if I just go for... I'm actually just going to go get my boat plane. Just take the guy out. Boat plane! Sea plane or whatever you want to call it. And now I don't have it marked. Let me go back. If I'm, maybe this will make him respawn. Because if he lands, that would be helpful. In the United States. Hey, deputy. Feeney's coming to you. Oh, okay. We just reset him. That's actually pretty handy. Okay, let's go up here. There he is. <gasps> no, I fell. Okay, climb back up. Get out! It's a trap! Go, go! Meet at the rendezvous. We'll finish them off there. Meet at the rendezvous? What? I don't want to meet at the rendezvous. Let me I will actually go I will actually fast travel. And see if I can get him to respawn again. And I'll try an RPG him. At least we figured out how to cheese it to get the guy to respawn every time. Do I have an RPG? Launch it you, lets you guide the rocket. Well, that's too expensive, but that would be handy. We'll try the RPG because you suggested it. We need to go to the place where he flies in over us. Okay, Feeny here. We're just arriving. What's going on down My idea there? worked, maybe? Let's see. Let's see. I'm actually kind of hopeful because the helicopter does stop temporarily. Get out! It's a trap! Wow. <laughs> Got him. It did work. No more Feeny. No more drug there you go. Hats off to you, Micah. You got you you got the right ideas. Oh my god, okay. That was easy. I think my boy would be proud too. Sins of the father. Amazing. Okay, well we're almost two oh, I wanna do one more thing just so we can finish so we can get to the What's something quick we can do? Clinical study. Let me just, yeah, I'm just gonna 
See, I'm not capping like her. Yeah, I know you're not. We're so close to having the next, like, little, little bar filled. So I would like to, I'd like to end today with that bar filled up. Got a, Pick uh, up the punch. test oh, bait. I know. But that's what's gonna draw the angels. I'm sure it'll work. Like, you know, better than 50-50. Oh, so we are gonna go just some fishing. I love fishing. Fishing might be my favorite thing in games. Not. Uh we could do save hostages instead, actually. Because we only need to save two more hostages and then that mission's done question is where are their hostages i guess they're kind of everywhere aren't they but they're mainly along the main roads let me go to here we need to literally save two hostages and then we can call it a day today i think it's just finding the hostages I just know you find them along the side of the road, so I was going to go with that as the idea. Actually, maybe I go somewhere where I can actually spawn in a car. That might help. Where can I get a car? Hope County Jail. Get a car, drive down the road, look for hostages, free them, complete the mission. Be careful with the hostages? Yes, I will. I haven't been careful with the hostages for this entire playthrough, actually. I've been, um... I've killed quite a few. Which I don't want to happen. I will specifically not take the, um... The car with the gun on the top this time. So where's the main road? Yeah, let's just take the main road. This radio channels are not only probably full of copyright, but they're full of shit music as well. Man, it's bright. Remember Larry? Oh, dude. Larry, Larry is off with the aliens now he's living his best life or he's been probed to death one of the two we can only hope that it's uh, the former civilian rescue cool that's what another hostage done one more hostage Oh my god, there's a bull going after a, after a dude. I'm going to let you deal with that. I have no interest in helping you. I miss him. I kind of miss him too. Careful driving. I, I'm trying to be careful. <laughs> I am trying. On one more hostage. Oops. Don't know if there was any hostages in there. I don't think so. Let's just keep. Do we want to keep driving around? It's going to lead to nowhere. Just need one more hostage. Let's show if he lives his best life with the aliens. Yeah, that, that's all we can hope for. Well, that's all we can hope for. Come on. Oh, there's a hostage. Get 
Yes. You're saved. Yes. Let me be the first to thank you, Rook. You managed to track down all our missing persons. I'm going to have to stop calling you Rookie. It's no small deed. Outstanding job. Amazing. Serve and protect. And that should be. The faith, ha faith has call has called in the chosen to hunt you down. Okay. Well, with that in mind, we are gonna call it there, as I said, because I am hungry. Um, but yeah, basically, what should happen now is she's gonna come for me, and we'll probably have like a story related thing happen, um, which will be pretty interesting. Um, I will look back over the footage today and just check: Are we up to date with our trophies? 28 trophies. Yep. So we've gained a, a decent amount. We've, we've only gained a few today. Slowed down a little bit because we've got a lot of the miscellaneous ones done in the first area. Um, I need to sort of make a, a cheat sheet, like a checklist of all the ones I've done um, to just make sure that they're all in line. But today has been a really fun stream. Thank you very much for everyone who's joined in. Um, I will probably be back streaming at some point end of the week. Over the weekend, I will get another stream in. We might be going from here. We might be a little bit further into the game. Um, we will see what happens. But thanks for watching. I'll see you guys then. Bye-bye.